Hello YouTube, today I'm going to be comparing USB 3 to eSATA, SATA, however you say it, it's an acronym, and I'm going to be using an OCZ solid state drive with an Orico external enclosure. I think this design works really well. Um, I've used a couple of hard drives and solid state drives, they've been easy to switch and I've not had any problems yet. So you're going to need um, a USB 3 or eSATA port if you want this high speed. Um, it is backwards compatible, I'll show you that later, but this is the new micro connector for USB 3. And that's the eSATA cable. Unfortunately it's not powered so you do need USB plugged in as well to give it power. So this is the USB 2 test. The first test is going to be a variety of files, well, they're all video files, um, and it makes up, it comes to 2 gigabytes altogether. And the second test is going to be a single disk image, and that is 2.3 gigabytes. This video hasn't been sped up, slowed down or anything, this is the exact footage used from Hypercam. So altogether, USB 2 takes 39 seconds to copy the group of files. One thing to notice, it is a constant rate of whatever bytes per second, when I do test the others, they do seem to fluctuate quite a lot. So for the single file, USB 2 takes around 44 seconds. I've counted that from the frame of the video where it starts and starts. The additional power isn't actually needed, but for the purposes of the video, so no one's worried that there's any cheating going on, I'm going to plug it in. So straight away, USB is quite a lot faster, but um, I weren't quite impressed with how long it took. It still did take 32 seconds to copy the group of files. I did expect it to be quite a lot quicker than that, considering the advertised 5 gigabits per second. For the single file, USB 3 was quite a lot faster, um, totaled around 15 seconds. I was impressed with eSATA, it um, suppressed my expectations. Definitely the quickest for the group files, uh, however the data rate did, as I say, fluctuate quite a lot. It did still manage to pull it off in um, a very small 17 seconds though. I did think it would do it quicker but it still took 19 seconds to complete. USB 2 was definitely the slowest. USB 3 was faster and in some cases fastest. 
and ESATA uh, was fastest but in one case slower. In this graph less is better, in this graph the orange line the higher the better, yellow line lower the better.